Here we are outside Voyage Art Galleries celebrating Devon Open Studios now on for a whole, pretty much three weeks of September. Come over and check it out. One of the artists that were very kindly happy to, to say yes to the exhibit here was Kath Lauren and I really love her work, I really really do. And just look at this image here so colourful, really well painted and for the, those who do not know that is Frida Kahlo and I was hoping because I must confess I don't know that much about her Kath, hopefully you can fill in the details Yes, yeah, she was born in 1907 she died in 1954 she mm. was a, a Mexican painter best known for her brilliant coloured portraits um, that deal with such things as identity, the human body, body and death. Um, she um, had a disability. Um, she had poli subtracted polio when she was younger. Mm -hmm. And then she had a very bad accident in a bus, I believe. Mm -hmm. So she spent most of her life in a body cast. Wow. Um, she had about 30 operations in her lifetime. Wow, 30. Um, yeah, she had um, a very distinct unibrow, mm. which was uh, a symbol of hope, power, mm. and empowerment. Because um, I, I was just going to say that image kind of shows that unibrow yeah. empowerment. Yes. Didn't it? Sorry, yeah. go on, continue. Um, she left her home as a museum called Blue House, where she lived in Mexico. Yeah. yeah. There true. were a lot of pictures of her. Um, lots of people like her, they like the symbol of her. Mm. Um, she's always a hall of pictures with bright colourful. Yeah. And so is her home, which I'd like to visit one day. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's, I wouldn't mind too. To she sounds like an amazing woman and what she's had to cope with. Anyway, um, anyone who's interested in seeing other artwork of Free Carlo, come and check it out and also lovely other pieces from Kath that she's painted. Thanks, Sam.